Hey guys, pretty well, isn't it? <laughs> um, I suppose uh, explanation is why I haven't uploaded in such a long time. Um, fortunately, Roman had passed away the other day. On a serious note, hi. Been quite busy. Here we thinking, fucking hell, busy again, is he? Well, yeah. Um, since this pandemic, I've been trying to keep myself occupied. I've been going for walks, um, working on something I can't quite say because it's too early. But my fucking god, is it amazing! Um, it's set the bar like really high. This 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 has. I'm not saying what it is because it's top secret. It's not even directed by me, so that makes a fucking change, doesn't it? So none of this directed by Roman Lech, produced by Roman Lech, written by Roman Lech, none of that. I'm glad to say. Um, uh, we've got been working on a big film. That's what well, there's some about that. I need to really sit down and write exactly what I want. Because there's quite a bit in this film. There's quite a bit of lore and story and things to explain. But I do have a short film in the works. Uh, if I ever and that, if I announced it, which if, if if I didn't, I'll announce it now. Um, if I did announce it, it would have been called The Grateful Dead. I've changed that now. The title is now called La Rita. After a quick Google search, I realise it's uh, the same as a restaurant, which it will be referenced. But the real reason for it, me calling it La, uh, La Rita is because um, it's to do with the main characters. He had a bit of a Spanish background. And the name Rita was actually my great-grandmother's name. Rita Redgriff. And I, I don't know. I just I seem to like the, uh, think the name fit. And, well, there you go. Why am I... What am I going to do in this episode? I'm going to play... I'm going to play some very old Doom mods. By old, I mean... We're talking... Hmm... 2012... 2011... I've been doing this in the past in other channels like uh, me, Rebellion Force, but these had quite a bit to them. These don't have very much work in them, just well, work in them. So these are like a series of short little bits. And yeah, without further ado, that looks fucking tasty. Let's get in it. Wow. Do you know what? That, this is a first. This is the first ep episode in a long time where I haven't been a dick to the audience. I don't know, I feel like being nice today. That can soon change. Go fuck yourself. There you go. I lost it. There you go. Well, this is um, called Hexen is Ultra Violent back in the year 2011. Um, my main is the cleric. So, hmm, heretic music. Um, okay, I'll be I remember faintly what's in this. Yes. Yeah, the core parts don't match. Yeah, that's this is pretty much all there is to it really unfortunately. This is This is it. Let me just uh, give all because I do have custom weapons in this. Strange cross from Hexen 2. Gweet gun. Yeah, that's that's always to it. And uh, uh, oh, there we go, dagger throw. Sprites don't match. I know. Again, this is Hexen two.
Eat this bastard. Aquatus. I actually like the Aquatus. I don't know. It's, it's, it's underpowered, but I just I genuinely like the Aquatus. Hashtag buff the fucking Aquatus, you bastards. That's too long, isn't it? Alright, time for mage. This used to be my main. Yeah. So the mage is the sole reason I do that. I used to let Arthur do that. Yeah. Back in playtime um, in Avalok. Avalok? No, no. Open Hedge, sorry. The Premier School. Yeah. What a fucking shit show that was. Um. I used to play like imaginary doom and all that shit. Some days if I like shooting stuff, some days if I like casting magic and you know, you know all that shit. Facebook me again without my permission. Right, so that was Hexen's Ultraviolent. Uh, this one's called Cops and Robbers, also back in 2011. Oh my fucking god. This used to be a, it's supposed to be a multiplayer map mod, this was. Well, I can't play this music because it's um, copyrighted. Kenny Loggins, um, uh, Danger Zone. I went to the Danger Zone. Ah! Fuck off. I've had to turn the music off because um, copyright. So the idea is you play as cops or robbers and you break out. Oh, fucking hell! <laughs> oh, yeah, this, I didn't actually code this, by the way. This is actually something that picks up from the big one. Oh, yeah! The, the police officers have it fucking good. They've got their own disco hall! Bastards! <laughs> And held staff. But yeah, they. The, the police have some fucking. have some strange ambulance to deal with the uh, the crime rates. See, so yeah, I've, I've already made it out of the prison now. Stop fucking billy lipping in my ears, you bastards. Billy! No, stop! Fuck off! No! <laughs> That's the exit. Um, so yeah, yeah. Simple map design. Back when I was a, I was a novice at map design. So you got the, got the Marty Marty Bur. The hell staff. Me missile launcher. Phoenix Rod. Man, that's it. Can't play that neither because it's copyright. Um, it would have been um, My Chemical by. Finger 11? Yeah. Give me the drug they know I'm after. That one. So this should be for some sort of lava refinery with lava that doesn't hit you at all. It's just the underholes, just retextured with barrels that drop rockets. Oh shit. Are you serious? That's, is that it? Oh. Excellent. 
Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Pretty sure I'm trying to make it a train level at some point. I don't know if that's copyrighted. Um, it's from the... Uh, some black guy falling down a, a hill or something. I don't know if it's copyrighted. Um, for wondering why, how I found that, it's actually from the YTP from by Bristles. I can't remember what it's called, but it features Adrian Edmondson going like that. And then to the beat, it's him smacking Rip Mail's head on a desk. Just boom, boom, boom. Bit imbalanced there. Ah! Oh. Long Forge 2011. Oh my god. So back in the early days of Doom, uh, back when I was doing mods was it like Alien Progress. This is called Long Forge. Uh, I think the name graduates from Halo Forge mode or something like that. It's Long Forge sounded cool at the time. Uh, that is actually a picture of me washing the pots. Uh, I'm like... I'm like that, for some reason. I think the sun was in my eyes or something. And uh, I actually got a bottle of lock what's it, liquid in my hand. That's the same top I wore in on Welcome Guest. And to the bottom left, if you are not mistaken, no, it's not the same top. It's got a Miami or something on it. That is a nuke. For fucking reason. And it's to put me and my friends in the mods. Uh, it's basically to have everyone in this. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I'll play for us both. So this is like, supposed to be like fucking, holy shit, boss to the wall, action. That is, um, from real tournament. They don't attack you straight away, you gotta shoot them first. They fucking hit and all, because they've got maulers. Get the piss. Oh. See, I just got vaporised. Right, I'll play again as Jake, and then I'll play again as me. <laughs> nice timing. And uh, I'll show you the weapons. So yeah, we're supposed to have like, each of our own unique weapons and whatnot. Jake's in a mech suit or a robot or something. It is a, it's just a fucking cake war, really. And the balance was, um, he was great against organic targets, but against robots he sort of struggles. Some bullshit like that. So, uh, yeah, that's increased, that's Jake. Oh, I remember 
this gun. This is my fake weapon spat when I was younger. Do you fucking want? Hello? <laughs> fuck. What the fuck do you want? Hello? <laughs> oh, I never thought I'd ever get one of them on camera. <laughs> Alright, I'll try to set some bins out. Oh, come on, man. Get me a set. We're not recording. Why? <laughs> this is Doom Tune. I've cut the music out because it's copyrighted. Because it's um, Deadpool, where bodies hit the floor. This was back in uh, 1st of October 2011. My friend Chris Stevenson came round one day and decided to make a Doom mod. It's mainly a sprite replacement at the minute, but um, this is actually something that he drew. I mean, it, yes, it is in paint, but it's uh, quite an interesting art style. And stop that music because it's, it's Death Cargo Plasma Steam and the Beta. I'm so fucking about that. So yeah, it's basically just a sprite replacement. So your fist is like like a taser or something. I am pretty player. Yeah. Uh, no chainsaw. The G G6 is your pistol. You got a shotgun. And instead of a double barrel shotgun, how about two shotguns? Now this, you're thinking, what the fuck's that? That's actually a hand like that, and instead of a thumb, it's like a, like a automatic pistol. No, 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 he's not doing that, he's not a fucking, you know, Zico! No, not, nothing like that. I think it's meant to be a cannon. A rocket launcher. And finally, um, some makeshift laser gun for the plasma rifle. And no BFG. And that is all I have to say. Right, we're a little running low on battery and we for what to put it in the ball. So I will leave it there. Thank you very much for watching today's episode of uh, Women's Car Sim of Games. Tune, tune next time where we play Aperture Undead City, aka God Rest, you magnificent faggots. You have been watching the Women's Car Sim of Games channel. Be sure to check out the links in the description for more short films, entertaining videos, gaming videos, or check out our blog for future updates.